My name is Ross Kemp and you're joining me in Takistan. On this week's episode, we will be traveling with the 6th Airborne Division to the Muladoss district. As you may have noticed, I'm currently wearing standard British Army multicams. I'll be marching myself to HQ to speak with Captain Knight, the CO of the 6th Airborne Division. Toasty. This is Takistan. The hills and mountains are the 6th Airborne Division's new home for the next six months. I'll be joining them in their fight against the Taliban and trying to show the people at home what it is like to be a British soldier on the front line. My name is Ross Kemp and this is Takistan. On our way into the CO's okay. office. You'll be Sierra 1 1. You'll be taking your section to uh, the HLS where you'll be moving northwest. Ross came. We previously agreed. So if that's all okay with you. As you can go see, and, the CO uh, is debriefing his NCO. NCO stands for non. Okay, I'll be non commissioned. Sure. Let's go talk to Captain Knight. Captain Knight. Good just explain. Explaining to the people at home why you, the CEO of the Sixth Fall Airborne Division, has placed me in multi cams. Okay, um, the reason you've been issued with MTP um, is because we've been having a lot of contacts lately. You can hear the shooting actually going on in the background, and unfortunately, the local insurgency have been targeting reporters. So, for your own safety and that of the cameraman and that of the Sixth. We dish you with this uh, multi-terrain pattern uniform, which I'm expecting you to wear, if that's okay. For the people at home, what Captain Knight is actually saying is that by having me, Ross Kemp, in multi-cams, dressed the same as the soldiers, I will be providing a morale-boosting influence. Is that what you're saying, Knight? Uh, not quite, Ross. That's no, definitely what Captain Knight is saying. I would like to use that as an opportunity to say the fact that you're wearing our uniform does not make you a soldier of the sixth. And I do not want to hear any reports about you using any weapons you shouldn't be. Um, I did... I've unfortunately heard reports of you firing an RPG. And if I it's find not... evidence for that, you will be dismissed from the sixth. I will not have that. That is not true. I I've never fired a, 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 an RP, whatever you called it. Straight Ross. Drop it, drop it. Oh my god. I got one, I got one! Close got the down. Follow me! Captain is down. That is, that is, that is, no. Moving on, anyway, I'd, I'd like to know what today, for the viewers at home, what we will be doing. Okay, well, unfortunately, the uh, level of insurgency has been increasing quite a lot in the northwest of our AO. Um, for that reason, I'm sending out a fairly standard patrol being led by Corporal Anderson, who you just saw leaving. Um, they'll be taking a Chinook, uh, codenamed Pegasus. They'll be heading northwest to uh, HLS, where they'll be proceeding along the road, clearing out targets as they go. And uh, you don't need to know too much detail, but the ultimate clear point will be a, a smallish town called Nagara, but we're expecting some fairly hefty contact there. You say that again, we're engaging a town called Nigara. That's a negative, Ross. That's Nagara. It's in the northwest of this AO. N N <coughs> right. Okay, Captain Knight, I'd like to thank you very much for your time. You're obviously a very busy man. We will be now moving out. Is that my my bodyguard on the door? Yeah, yes, it, it is. It thank you. Yep. Over to the Chinook. And, uh, no fucking around, all right? I'll be sending you home. I don't fuck around. I'm a god. At ease, man. At ease. As you can see, for the people at home, I just had a very important chat with Captain Knight, the CO of the Sixth Fairborn Division. As you can see, as you witnessed, Captain Knight is very, very impressed with the influence that I'm having on the soldiers of the 6th Fairborn Division. Captain Knight has seen it fit that I, Ross Kemp, 
Go and receive myself a rifle. Let's go get ourselves a rifle. You will not be oh, taking fucking hell. Rifle, Shit. I didn't say that. We don't have time for this. 1-1's uh, one, about to move out, so if you follow me over to the Pegasus, and you do not take a weapon. Why didn't you good? fucking tell me he was coming? Why didn't you tell me? 1-1, one, one, this is Alpha Zero. Uh, can you prep the section to board the Pegasus? We'll be moving out in one mic. Over. Right, guys, we're gonna be flying into HLS Golf Grid 007077 in the Ballard Pass. From there on, we're gonna be moving on foot in a side column. We're gonna move through Maladast. We're probably gonna set up a fire team in the hills somewhere in Grid 017077. But we'll have to see at the uh, actual terrain first. After we have captured and cleared Maladast, we will uh, neutralize any uh, enemy weapon catchers and move on up northeast. We're gonna clear the uh, rest of the uh, small villages on the road, and we're gonna be moving further till we get to Gospandi. From Gospandi, we're gonna capture the uh, rest of the uh, grid regroup before we move northwest to Nagara. Do we have any questions? Take that as a no. Right. I'll get the uh, helicopter ready then. Okay, just a few words. We've had... Uh, we, you will obviously be going into a uh, populated area, so I'm going to be civvies. I just want to remind you again about the ROE. So um, keep an eye... I'm Ross for, Kemp! Uh, shoot when fired upon. Just hold it for a sec, Ross. Um, keep an eye out for IEDs. We had a vehicle... I'm Ross Kemp! Last week. One sec, Ross. And also, as you can hear, there's going to be Ross with you, so there's going to be media, yeah? So I want to see an outstanding performance. Right, you can uh, fall out now with uh, Anderson. Right, face on your right. feet. Ross, you'll be assigned out, to Delta Fire column. Team of the first section. Is that understood? I remember my days in the ultimate Delta Force. Easy going, let's go. Yeah. Right, good luck, Dale. Should I grab my rifle? That's a negative, Ross. If I see so you I grab the rifle, rifle, you'll be on the first Hercules home. Now, the Hercules is a VIP aircraft given to those who are awarded the Victoria Cross. Captain Knight might be suggesting that I am eligible for the Victoria Cross by sending me home on a Hercules. We're now boarding the heavily armoured. Apache helicopter. It has howitzers on both sides to engage threats from below. <laughs> you hear this guy? Having by and behind the chinny. As you can see, the Sick Fearborn Division are displaying their professionalism. They are using the Mark III. The mar the mar the the rifles of the British Army. Journey other way. I'm sat next to Private Simon. Private Simon. Of the sick fable. Safe on ground. Safe on ground. Safe on ground. Safe on ground. Go, go, go. Safe on ground. Oh, but it was my time to sign! <laughs> Why am I stuck in the fucking Chinook? Guys, I'm stuck in the Chinook! <laughs> oh, stop, please, no. Man down! Man down! Man down! Get him. We have just landed and taken an immediate casualty. Unfortunately, Private... More spacing, guys. Private McLaughlin, is that his name? McLaughlin. The man on the ground, also known oh, as no, Irish, with me. was shocked and awed to find I out that I, Ross Kemp, was flying behind. on his helicopter. The man has had a panic oh, attack and is very pleased oh, yeah, that no. I, oh, Ross Kemp, and, and moving in forward, with the so men of 6th Airborne Division. Let's have a uh, chat with Private McLaughlin. Sure. Private what McLaughlin, while you're just down um, on the floor, please tell us and the cameraman and the viewers at home what has just uh, happened I, I to you. I got shot in the arse, as you can see I'm bleeding 
Well, well, that up you, well, uh, well obviously McLaughlin's under the morphine at the moment. What he's actually trying to say is that he's very happy to be serving alongside me, Ross Kemp. Isn't that You've right, McLaughlin? Yeah, it is, mate. Uh, it was actually what actually happened to That's you, mate, was as you got off the like Chinook, it. you actually suffered a panic Bloody attack fuck. because I, Ross Kemp, was sat next to you. How does it feel to serve alongside oh, someone like myself? Head into the back of the Jenny when we, uh, I'm uh, proud of it, even though you caused me to nearly die, but I'm um, pretty proud. He's currently on his period. <clears throat> what do you mean? I nearly caused you to die. Do you not see this bird that you... Uh, we're moving on to the outside of the, uh, the section. Right, so, the Anderson, get them on the move, will you? so right, we found Captain Knight here. Captain Knight is very happy to have us on this operation. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're just going to sit close to him, and I'll see you in the AO.